Hi, we get people asking us all the time, I don't really have a chronic condition going on or chronic pain. Can I get or benefit from a stem cell therapy? It's a very good question. This is Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell, the global leader in regenerative therapies. The answer is absolutely yes. One of our most common reasons that people come to our providers to get stem cell therapy is for overall health and wellness. Anti-aging is what a lot of these people call it. How does it do its, how does it benefit folks? Well, the stem cells that get administered to a patient seek out inflammation. And that was shown at a Harvard Medical School study years ago as to how do they know where to go. All right, so if you get an IV therapy and the stem cells are circulating through your bloodstream, they seek out areas of inflammation. And when you have a chronic condition, inflammation comes along with that. Whether it's a kidney issue, diabetes, neuropathy, you name it, inflammation is emanating from those areas and that's where those stem cells will go. Or exosomes, if you get an exosome therapy. And then when the stem cells and exosomes deposit themselves into those areas, they will say, look, you, you, this is kind of, you're kind of sick this to a cell. They'll say, you're sick, you need to reprogram yourself. You need to regenerate yourself, and here's how you're going to do it. They kind of give them the blueprints of how to move forward, all right? So for anti-aging, it's very, very helpful for more energy, vitality, helping people to sleep better, and it can help um, improve what's called the markers of aging, all right? And it can help with these subclinical conditions that we all have, like for instance, you, you can do pretty well with your kidneys with like 10% of your kidney function. So if you've lost 30 or 40% of your kidney function, you're not going to know that, all right? But your kidneys are going to be giving off inflammation. Same thing with COPD. You may have decreased lung volume, but it's not clinically evident yet. It can help improve those issues before they become clinically problematic, okay? All right, so if you like what you're hearing, please smash that like button.